Dive into the depths of the unknown with underwater scaries as we unveil the top 10 deep sea discoveries. Did you know that 95% of the world's waters remain unexplored? The deepest ocean regions present formidable challenges in both biological and engineering aspects, making the exploration of these abyssal depths a fascinating endeavor. Anything that emerges from this mysterious realm often appears bizarre and almost alien to us. In this video, we illuminate some of the most astonishing deep sea creatures that may defy belief. If you're intrigued by these incredible discoveries, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to Underwater Scaries for more captivating content. Join us as we count down the top 10 deep sea discoveries, showcasing the wonders hidden beneath the waves. Number 10. Weird Octopuses Octopuses are already pretty strange creatures. They have eight flexible arms, a soft and squishy body, nine brains, three hearts, and even blue blood. They're super smart, almost like dolphins and orangutans. But guess what? The regular octopuses we know aren't as weird as their deep sea versions. Let's talk about the flapjack octopus first. It lives deep in the ocean between 200 to 1500 meters down, mostly found in the eastern Pacific and a bit in the mid-Atlantic Ocean. It's tiny, kind of adorable, with a see-through body and eyes that seem to sparkle. It's way different from the ordinary octopus that looks a bit stretched out. Now imagine making the flapjack octopus more see-through and giving it a rounder body. That's the Casper octopus. This spooky-looking friend was first discovered in the deep Hawaiian seas. Here's a crazy fact. Casper octopuses lay their eggs on dead sea sponges and guard them with their lives, not leaving or eating until they eventually die. Talk about dedication. For a Disney-like creature, we've got the Dumbo octopus. Its nickname comes from its ear-like fins just like the character Dumbo. Similar to the Flapjack and Casper octopuses, it's smaller than the average octopus. This cute buddy can survive at depths as deep as 7,000 meters below sea level. Isn't that fascinating? Number nine, anglerfish. When we dive into the deep sea, we can't ignore the weird creatures with super wide jaws. At the top of this list is the anglerfish, known for its unique hunting method. It uses a strange luminescent appendage on its head to lure prey close to its mouth. But that's not all that's peculiar about it. The anglerfish has a mating process similar to humans. The male spends its life searching for a single female through pheromones she releases. Once found, he bites onto the female and fuses onto her like a parasite. He gets his nutrients from her to survive and becomes a ready-to-reproduce on-demand testicle when the female needs sperm. It's quite a bizarre way of life. Next up is the viper fish, measuring around 60 centimeters or 23 inches long. It's like an anglerfish, but even more alien looking. Its fangs can open wide to almost 90 degrees, and its bioluminescent lure can attract shallower fish to their doom in an instant. Even more grotesque are the deep sea dragonfishes, a category of wide jawed monsters that make the viper fish seem like their incomplete cousins. What makes them stand out is their ability to produce not only blue light, like many other deep sea creatures, but also red light. To emit this light, they use organs called photophores, usually located in front of their eyes. While the red light might not serve as an alert since most prey can't see it, it lets the dragonfish stealthily illuminate their prey. It's a whole different level of eerie in the deep sea. Number eight, pelican flounder. The primary challenge for any deep sea creature isn't really the absence of light, but the immense pressure at those depths. The pelican flounder tackles this challenge ingeniously by adopting a simple solution. It makes itself as flat and flexible as biologically possible. This results in a creature that combines the nightmarish features of the anglerfish with the quirkiness of an average flounder. Native to the Western Pacific and Indian Oceans, not much is currently known about the pelican flounder as they are rarely observed in their natural habitat. However, if we were to highlight one specific trait that makes it truly unique as a deep sea resident, it would be its baby form. Pelican flounder larvae are some of the most alien looking entities in the deep sea, resembling the otherworldly appearance of comb jellies. These larvae, like tiny mosquitoes of the ocean, are enveloped within transparent flesh, 
only developing into their normal opaque brown color as they grow. The mysteries of the deep sea continue to unfold with fascinating creatures like the pelican flounder. Number 7. Giant Isopods and Amphipods While ancient trilobites and modern horseshoe crabs may appear cute, the deep sea floor harbors some creepy crawlies that transport you back millions of years to the age of giant insects. Take a closer look at the giant isopod. Closer. Even closer. Its extraterrestrial appearance with those enormous eyes might make you question if it's some mutated form of lice. No need to worry about it jumping on your face. These creatures are more scavengers than active hunters. They typically thrive in colder, deeper environments, explaining their absence in most temperate deep regions. There are other gigantic deep sea crustaceans with an unusual, alien-like appearance, such as the supersized amphipods. They seem like grotesque, mutated versions of their tamer counterparts in shallower seas and on land. The good news is, despite their intimidating looks, most of these deep sea creatures, including the wide-jawed hellspawns mentioned earlier, are not as active and menacing to other species as they might seem. Moreover, their remote habitats mean we're unlikely to encounter them on land, making them less intimidating in reality. Number 6. Spider Crabs When we talk about crustaceans, crabs undergo some truly bizarre transformations in the deep sea. This time, it's not just about their size, but an entirely different dimension of weirdness. Take Japanese spider crabs, for instance. They don't just have the longest legs among crabs, but are literally the longest-legged arthropods ever. These creatures can grow up to around 5 meters in length. Despite their relatively small body, their main body can still be a bit larger than the average human head. Another eerie variation is the Hoff Crab, a ghastly version of its normal counterpart. The deep, dark depths have rendered it almost featureless in terms of color, giving it a pure white shell of nothingness. The Hoff Crab earned its name due to the dense covering of setae, hair-like structures resembling the famous mane of actor David Hasselhoff. It thrives near hydrothermal vents, where its setae feed upon sulfur-oxidizing bacteria. Even stranger are the various species of strange spiny crabs, which have yet to be properly classified or identified due to their recent discovery. One thing that's clear, though, is that the deep-sea environment they inhabit must be incredibly harsh for them to evolve several steps above the crustacean defense tree. The mysteries of the deep sea never fail to amaze. Number 5. Colossal Squid One verified legend of the deep sea is deep sea gigantism, showcasing creatures of monstrous proportions. The colossal squid, exceeding human size by more than twice, occasionally surfaces in the Antarctic southern seas. Though rarely seen in its habitat, it's the world's largest invertebrate. The giant squid, about a third of its size, is still sizable and has been briefly spotted in its natural surroundings. The vampire squid, a peculiar mix of squid and octopus, is not as huge but features a monstrous appearance with its cape-like webbing and spine-studded tentacles. It's a particulate scavenger, not a bloodsucker, adding to the mysteries of the deep sea. In the realm of deep sea squids, the vampire squid deserves special mention. Although not as gigantic, it exhibits a weird transitional body, technically classified as a mix between a squid and an octopus. Number four on the list, the harp sponge. As intimidating as sea anemones and similar creatures can be, they've shown us that the oceans harbor various mobile predators. It's only natural that the deep, dark sea introduces something even more unsettling. The harp sponge, resembling its name, appears as an innocuous underwater sponge shaped like a harp. While many inert deep sea creatures feed on filtered marine matter, this one takes a more proactive approach by capturing its prey with Velcro-like hooks. Once ensnared, it fully envelops and digests its victim. Its menu typically includes small fishes, especially those unable to escape its microscopic hooks, but it has been observed feasting on crustaceans as well. Number 3. Sea Toads The sea toad may have a straightforward name, but it perfectly captures the essence of this peculiar creature dwelling in the depths of the ocean. Picture an amphibian transformed by the crushing pressures of the deep sea. Imagine a fish flattened from front to back, equipped with tiny legs. In the words of Sir David Attenborough, 
It has spent so long in the depths that its fins have evolved into something resembling more useful feet. While not the most aesthetically pleasing creature in the sea, the sea toad offers a direct visual representation that strikes a balance between the familiar and the otherworldly. Similar to its close relative, the aforementioned anglerfish, the sea toad is also a formidable ambush predator, patiently lurking until its unsuspecting prey becomes its next source of sustenance. Number 2. Savannah Fours Deep sea savannah fours are extended lines of jellyfish-like entities connected together, guided solely by the organisms in front and behind them. They can reach incredible lengths, comparable to or even surpassing a blue whale, making them among the longest animals globally. Their survival hinges on preying upon smaller animals, utilizing stinging cells. While some variations of savannah fours exhibit a simple, long and slender configuration, others boast even more bizarre physical forms. It's worth noting that most, like the classic Portuguese man o' war, don't reside in the depths of the deep sea, and thus aren't part of our collection of dark oddities. Number 1. Gulper Eels In the eerie depths of the ocean, nothing embodies the literal stuff of nightmares quite like the gulper eel. The very mention of its name conjures disturbing images, evoking complete dread for those fortunate enough to witness its existence. Its most defining trait, an enormous mouth capable of extending and snapping like a snake, allows it to consume prey that creatures of its size typically couldn't swallow. Coupled with its slender body, whip-like tail, and the ability to bend easily into the abyss, the gulper eel surpasses the monstrous anglerfish in terms of terror. Thriving in a wide range of warm climates across the world's oceans, these creatures dominate vast expanses of the ocean. If this video sparked your curiosity about more deep-sea creatures, check out our previous video by clicking the screen. Also, share your thoughts on which creature you found most bizarre in the comments section below. Thanks for watching.